Hello everybody, so welcome back to another Bakugan unboxing video. Today we'll be unboxing this box which is the Bakugan Ultimate Pack. So this pack has 6 figures inside, 2 special attacks and 4 cores. I'm not too sure which wave this is from. It should be either wave 1 or wave 2. Anyway, this is the Amazon exclusive pack. I like the packaging which it comes in. Uh, the, it has uh, one side which is red and one side which is, which is blue. Very very nice uh, design for the package. Okay, anyway, have a look at the front, have a look at the back, you can see all the different characters. We have Octagon, Special Attack Mantid, Special Attack Nilius, Special Attack Dragonoid, the core version of uh, Titanium Dragonoid, and Nilius, all in uh, exclusive colors. Have a look at the barcode in case you're interested. The date is 16 of June, 2023. So have a look at the top, the side, the other side, and the bottom. Here it has uh, information for the red side, I call it the red side. Two misfits and one dragon. I believe this is Dragonoid. And for the blue side, we have one dragon clan, one insect clan, and one aquatic clan. Okay, this is Nilius. Okay, so without further ado, let's open up and have a look. Once again, the packaging is not very good. Ooh, they have a very nice exclusive rip card, translucent yellow. It's like the limited edition Ventry. That is a uh, translucent blue. This translucent yellow. Nice. Okay, a pair of cards. Oh, so it's like that. Six holes for six Pokemon. Yeah, I forgot to see what, what was inside. Yeah, there were six tops, three power rings, six bottoms, six Pokemon character cards. Not sure whether it's three gate cards or something else. Uh, special type bottoms and one rip card. We saw the rip card. It's very, very nice. Exclusive to this box. Okay, so six Pokemon in six packs like that. So let's take out the cards first and see what was inside. So this was what is included inside. We have our Wave 1 checklist. So I guess it's a Wave 1 pack. The Customer Care Service Card, Robots Code, 3 Gate Cards. So there are no Roller Cards in here. Just 3 Gate Cards, 6 Character Cards, and 3 Special Attack Cards. One of them is the Titanium. Yeah, just to show this, this is the Wave 1 list, which was basically not a list at all. Okay, let's take a look at the Gate Cards. M01 and QUB, yeah, Aquatic B. M01 DRAB and M01 DRAC Dragon C. Okay, all these we've seen before. No special cards. Let's see our Bakugan. Oh, they have a very very nice color. So the ultimate packs have this sort of uh, colors. So it's different from the Walmart packs, which were I think it was a yellow circle inside. For the street brawls, it was like graffiti style. For the Amazon ones, it, it looks like this. It's like being flooded with fire or water. And this is Nilius, the core version, M01103CC. So it was uh, right, right at the end. This is Octagon, M01100CC. This is Gold Special Attack Mantid, M01196CC. Gold Special Attack Nilius, M0195CC, with a plus two, if you have two dragons, plus 200. And Titanium Dragonoid, M01104CC. I do not know which is the special attack. There's a misprint. One of them should be a SA instead of a T. Anyway, this is M0194CC. See which one is from the stats. So the core version should be 200, 400, and 500, which is this. So this is the core. This core. So this is a picture of the core. 104 is the core. See here, it's uh, 200, 400, and 500. The other one is 500, 300, and 400, which is pretty high, right? Insanely high. Usually it's up to 1000, this is adding up to 1200. So this is the core card, this is the special attack card. Yeah, cool, very, very nice color scheme, I like the color scheme. Very nice color scheme. Okay, and the three special attacks we have, ooh, very, very nice. It's a totally different kind of color scheme, burning sort of uh, design. This Steel Warrior, Steel Warrior is for Dragonoid, if I'm not wrong. Scotch Rips for Nilius. And Staff Lills is for Mantid. Yeah. I like these exclusive sets where they actually make some effort to differentiate it from the normal cards. Makes you want to go and collect it. Yeah. Okay, so these are the cards. Okay, let's start. Who should we start with? Let's open the cores first. So this, this is Titanium Dragonoid. A red translucent version. Looks very similar to the Mythix. Except it has much more paint. The Misfit Clan symbol here. 15th of February 2022. Wow, it's 2022. That was a very long time ago. That means this was in production for a very, very long time. 
This was more than one one year ago. Yeah, this is definitely the nicest one so far. But I think it still had the same problems. Oh, the feet. They even painted the feet. Yeah, the same problem. Okay, let's compare with the Mythic. So Mythic Dragonoid, Titanium Dragonoid. This is much later even. This is the 2nd of December. Right. So essentially, they are the same color. Looks like the same color. This is slightly deeper red. The red is deeper for this. See, this is, has a more orange hue to it. See, of course, the color here is black. The Misfit symbol is orange. It's silver. Of course, these, the rest of the parts are not painted. You can, of course, uh, try to customize this to look like this, if you want to. But it's not the same color. It's red. It's orange. Deep orange. Yeah, okay. So this is uh, Titanium Dragonoid, the ultimate pack version. Red color version of Nilius. I see the date. Date is 15 February. Oh, it's all the same date from last year, February. A long time ago. Yeah, Nilius. Nilius. All the all the clan symbols are orange. Somehow red doesn't really suit Nilius. I would have thought that they would put this in black. But if they were to put this in black, what would these accent colors be? I, I'm not sure. The red doesn't really suit it as much as uh, Dragonoid. I'm not sure what I should compare this with. I'm guessing the closest I can compare this with is the Diamond Nilius. Actually, it looks the same. It's just that they colored this into red. Of course, it's silver instead of black. Yeah, can't really compare too much because it's totally different. There's no red based translucent Nilius. Yeah, okay, so this Nilius. The other core would be this octagon, another specially colored variant of blue octagon. I think till the uh, recording of this video, there are six or seven, seven different variants of blue octagon. It's just ridiculous. Yeah, anyway, this is a, like an inverse colored uh, scheme of uh, octagon. See, they inverse the colors. This is a light blue. Looks strange. This actually looks like an underwater creature because it looks translucent. And like if you were to put it in water, it looks like a, it's really in the water. Yeah, let's see the date. Of course, see the date. Yeah, it's the same date. Oh, they're on the same date. 15th of uh, February 2022. Yeah, I got a couple of octagons here to compare with. See, this is a darker version of blue. Not really inverse colors. It's a lighter, lighter kind of blue. Yeah, mythic. So you can see there are a couple of uh, different vari uh, different versions, variants of a uh, blue translucent octagon. This is the mythic, mythic, uh, mythic version. These two, I think, belong to some pack. I'm not sure which pack. I think the Walmart packs. This is the ultimate pack. The ultimate pack is this, the one that looks really, really very different. So it's hard to hard to get wrong. So many stuff. Mantid together with star flails, blue version. Let's see the date, twenty third. February 2023. Oh, this is 2023. The cores were 2022. It looks like the inverted colors of the Walmart pack. Yeah, the Walmart pack doesn't come with the correct power ring. There are two versions of the Walmart Mantid. One came with Scotch Whips, the other one came with Flex, Splash Hammer. Both are the wrong uh, power rings. This is the only one that came with the correct power ring, which is Star Flails. But you can see the color scheme is like inverted. It's an inverted color scheme. This way. Except for this part, this part is uh, still yellow. I just use a spare record. Oh, very, very smooth. It's very, very smooth. It sounded like a car engine, you know? It really sounded like a car engine. Let's try it again with the Walmart version. Okay, cool. So let's see inside. Inside it looks like this. this is, flywheel is always gold in color. It's the same flywheel, yeah. Bottom is the same, so just different. Just a different color. Okay, so this is cemented. Okay, next let's look at Nilius. Yeah, basically they're following the theme of this pack, which is red versus blue. That's why everything is either red or blue. Red team versus the blue team. So Nilius is blue. And it has chrome wings. That's so weird. Yeah, I checked the box. The box shows that it's the correct power ring. So this is chrome wings, but the card says it's scotch whips. But this is definitely not scotch whips. Scotch whips should be this. 
So this is uh, Nidia's blue version, Ultimate Pack version. Very nice colors, very contrasty. Date. 23rd February 2023, FWS. So all the special attacks were uh, this year. The cores were a uh, much earlier. Now uh, this is not so smooth. This is actually pretty tight. Uh, this is really very, very, very tight. Yeah, let's just have a match with the Street Brawl Nivius. Okay, so this is Nivius. As I mentioned, this is uh, Team Blue. So it's a very, very contrasty dark blue yeah unfortunately i don't know why they included this which is uh, chrome wings should be this which is scotch ribs so i can just take a look at the difference can't really compare it because it's like a totally different color scheme yeah. so this is Nilius blue version and the last one okay so this is not steel warrior this is blazing warrior the one that belongs to Go and titanium special attack dragonoid. It says here it's steel warrior. Steel warrior is correct in terms of the name. This is steel warrior. Steel warrior is a more circleish kind of uh, design. This is blazing warrior, which is the go and titanium special attack dragonoids uh, powering. So it's a mismatch of powerings. Now at this stage where we are at wave three, we can finally make these conclusions that they have put the wrong rings it, it becomes very very confusing especially since it's supposed to tie in together with these cards but they don't have a look at this very very nice colors translucent bottom same date 23rd february 2023 oh this is also super tight oh. yeah the, the only one which was smooth was this mantid see it's so smooth but nivius and dragonoid are very very like stuck I have to use so much strength to push it in. Okay, anyway, let's try it. Is it the same mole? Wait. What mole is this? Okay, this is Titanium Dragonite. This is Gold Dragonite. Why does the Gold Dragonite have Steel Warrior? As I mentioned, it's all a mess. This is Gold Special Attack Dragonoid, which was supposed to come with Blaze Swords, but this came with Steel Warrior. This is a this is the Titanium Dragonoid, which was supposed to come with Steel Warrior, but it came with Blazing Warrior. It reminds me of the uh, Baku Neon. Remember Baku Neon? I just got one here. So this is a uh, Cyborg Helios Baku Neon. Looks same color, right? Very nice colors. Thank you. Yeah, so that was the unboxing of the Bakugan Ultimate Pack. So just to recap what was in the box. There's the red team versus the blue team. The red team had uh, Titanium Special Attack Dragonoid, Titanium Dragonoid Core Version, as well as Nilius Core Version. On the blue team, we have the Gold Special Attack Nilius. We have Gold Special Attack Mantid, as well as Octagon. All of these are exclusive to this pack. Can't find them anywhere else. Okay, anyway, this has been my unboxing video for today. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy this content, please click the like button and subscribe. See you next video. Thanks. Bye.